One of Granted, the protagonists. Yeah. Please. And don't remind me of the... F Go ahead. I was gonna say, just don't look up the, the way the internet looks at Elsa and her sister. It's not fun. Oh, uh, yeah, I remember Katie. I was talking Holy to Katie shit. when we saw the, uh... Oh! God, I'll bet Shadow was dizzy as fuck at this point. God damn. <laughs> Apparently <laughs> Katie was upset with the final version of Frozen because she had also kept up with, uh, like, the development history of Frozen. Because ah, we, Jesus! We geeked <laughs> out when we saw some of the old, um... How were they called? I forget the name off the top of my head, but anyway, at the the um, Academy Museum, and they had all this, the concept art, that's what I mean, the concept art for uh, Elsa and all this other stuff, and she was upset that she was just a misunderstood good guy. Despite the fact uh, that it was pretty clear they were going to make her a villain. I mean, the original story, she's a villain. Mm-hmm. But Disney's always had a thing oh, for Oh, Jesus, that I mean, was like, a close one. <laughs> Hunchback of Notre Dame. I no, no, I mean, I, I mean to be fair. Go ahead. Yeah, I was gonna just say, I mean to be fair, the Hunchback of Notre Dame still worked despite the um. The oh yeah, it still they did to the worked. But like I'm saying, like in the original novel, everyone it was died. Brutal. Basically. Yeah, no, it was brutal. Yeah. Like holy everybody shit. was an asshole too. I remember that there was a live action version of it that was from like yeah. I think 1939. Yep. Yeah, I think it was from the 30s. And now I've been hearing recently that Disney's trying to do their own live action adaptation of it. I'm like, no. Oh. Oh, wait, wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, 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 damn it. Come I on. mean, on one hand, I don't want to accept, I don't really want to bother with the live adaptation. But if I the won't. rumors that, if the rumors of Peter Capaldi, you know, 12th Doctor, is would be playing Frollo, I would be interested in that. Hmm. Eh, I just don't support them, period. Like, the only time I went and saw one of those Disney live-action movies, and yet, yeah, no, Christopher Robin does not count. That's a different spin. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I the only live-action movie I saw in theaters, and I kind of regret it in hindsight, was The Lion King. I mean, to I, be fair, it was it is the movie that everybody doesn't like. Next to the last the last yeah. one I saw was uh, Jungle Book. Yeah, that was the only one I I cared I was interested in, mainly because I could technically see it work. I and... wanted to see it because Christopher Walken playing King Louis seeing Ubi Doo is one thing I, I need to see. And I Which, laughed my ass off for the entire scene in the movie theater. Oh, really? I, it, yes. was, it was good. It was good. We ah, that's the one movie I think that people like at least should give a chance, despite it's a Disney live adaptation. It actually, it actually did a pretty good job telling the story of the Jungle Book. And as much as she's on the movie for a long time, Scarlett Johansson as Ka is actually intimidating. I still find it weird that there was like another remake like 20 years after that one uh, Jungle Book movie from the 90s. Oh, oh yeah! God, I remember that one. Apparently, I didn't notice until I saw the Nostalgia Critic review of it that it was the same director who did The Mummy. I'm like, oh, it's all making sense now. The brutal nature it has. You have the scene where a guy sinks in quicksand. You have a guy who falls to his doom after holding a like giant rock. A guy gets crushed inside a temple. Amazing. I saw that shit as a kid. That was brutal to watch. I saw I mean, that, a... and I remember like playing the video game on PC. <laughs> I mean, as a kid, I saw The Devil's Backbone by Guillermo del Toro, which not a not a movie you should see for you should see as a kid. <laughs> and I saw The Mummy as well as a kid. It did get me interested into liking ancient Egyptian stuff. But definitely a movie that I don't think a little kid should watch, considering, you know, creepy as fuck mummy. Oh, Joker THX has an interesting question. What about the live-action 101 Dalmatians? I actually kind of like that one. Like, it's the same, same story, yeah. but it's without dialogue. And that was a different spin on it. And also, I like that they had some additional, like, animal characters. And they had more for personality than any of the human characters. And well, I Glenn haven't... Close says Corello was great too. Oh yeah, yeah no, Glenn Close was an exception. 
Yeah, I haven't seen. I remember I didn't see the the uh, 101 Dalmatians live adaptation, but I know that some people do like Glenn Close as Corella. She, and I think that's one of the reasons people enjoyed the second one, even though most people try to pretend that 102 Dalmatians wasn't a thing. But they, at least they got Glenn Close as Corella still. I, yeah. I'm a little mixed on 102 Dalmatians. Like, I don't, I don't hate it by any means. Oh, Jesus! What the fuck happened? I think I mostly like it for, again... Glenn Close's performance is cool. I mean, you can definitely tell she's having fun with the movie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, yeah. I know thing, I would. The thing I remember the most with the 102 Dalmatians is that... Uh, is the uh, final act where she's in that cake factory and all the dogs are just putting her through the entire baking process. And it also <laughs> it's also weird that they're using choir music. Like, it's all meant to be, like, brutally Serious. epic. Yeah, I so it's it. like, ah, and it's just like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I they didn't... must have been on drugs when making this movie. Yeah, really. How then again, to... huh? how am I supposed to take on those big guys? You ignore it. Also, then again, I shouldn't be surprised considering, um, and I will always use this as a prime example of Disney being crazy when it came. When they used a fucking, um, what was the name of the guy? That's that that fucking guy who they always say he doesn't get his, he doesn't eat his white outs. He what doesn't his name? eat his white what? Hold on, I'm trying to remember. Um, DJ Khaled. They when Disney used the DJ oh, Khaled song in Ducktales 2017. Oh, that's the I, the all I do is win, 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 win no matter what. No lie. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. What is this? Pick nails. What does this do? You can dig into the ground to wall. Select dig into the action window. Simply press B when you're in midair. Okay, so it's the same move like, um... Yeah. Okay. Shove a close. Go back in that room, Golden. This one? Yeah. It's oh. right next to... It's right, it's right next to the shark head. Oh. <laughs> on the left. Oh, but, there it is. Oh. Uh, but, yes, in, um... Damn it! In... In DuckTales 2017, they used a fucking DJ Khaled song where the character Glomgold literally dances thinking that Scrooge McDuck is dead. Oh, that was so funny. That was the best part of the... I think that just summarizes how awesome that show was. And the fact there that Disney go. looked at the Frank, at bitch. the creator Frank and the crew and went, Yeah. We got the rights of the song, and you can use this part for a scene. It's like, Disney, are you guys high on something? Nothing. All I do is win, 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 no matter what. The thing I remember from, what's his name? Glomp, um... Glom Gold. Glom Gold. Glom Gold. Okay, so I do remember that... What am I supposed to do with this? Hmm. I love what they did with Glum Gold in that series. Anyway, no, um, I like that he did like a silly remix of DuckTales, and then like he goes like making fun of a Scrooge McDuck, and then all of a sudden, several, several lawyers are there, like all of a sudden there. Oh, mm -hmm. the Glum Tales remake. <laughs> yeah. God, I'll say it once and I'll say it again. Disney unfairly screwed that show over alongside the Owl House and, I think, Amphibia? Like, I'm I'm happy with the way it ended. I just would have liked, like, more continuation and, like, the whole Darkwing Duck thing to be... Oh, they, because they teased Nega Duck at the end of that episode, and I'm like, where's my Nega Duck? Okay, where's maybe I should Negaduck? say that say that's, that sentence because it probably could be misinterpreted for something else. All right, so uh, I, I need to hold up the conversation for a second. Ryza, what is this thing? Riza? Riza. He's AFK. Oh, he may be AFK. Uh, oh, there he is. What? Right, Gold right, right, what this thing is. Yeah, what's this hexagon thing? It's nothing. That's that's like where the item was. Okay. Alright, so I guess I have to go up here. Or not. I got distracted by DuckTales. <laughs> There's no way to climb up there, is there? Nope. Okay, uh, I guess not. 
All right, you get I out still of this remember. Room. I still remember watching the the Ducktales 2017 series premiere at like what was it, Brony? Oh Con no! Oh no! No, I remember oh, yeah. that too. God damn it! All right, so to beat that thing, don't let it see you. You just hide from it. Oh. That sounds easier said like, than done. I mean, if it comes near you, all you do is hide behind a pillar or a box or some shit, and it can't notice you. Also, Riley, yes, I do have those memories of 2017 BronyCon when we all went and saw uh, DuckTales in the, um... I forgot what the hotel was called. Uh, it was... <sighs> Fuck. It, it's the was... one that Josh went to. Yeah, it was... <sighs> Trying to remember the name of the hotel. I, I I remember staying there at one point too. Yeah, I stayed there at BronyCon 2019. I'm trying to remember the name of the hotel though. Ian Todd Fuck. and Ryan Gold. Uh, uh, I hope to go to BabsCon and Everfree next year. Same. I just want to see my boyfriend. God damn it! Even in this one, there are fucking ghosts everywhere. I guess they got too Under high, according to this shape. <laughs> what is that, an egg? What, are you talking Eggs? about- Eggs! Are you talking about this? No, nah, sorry, I was looking at the uh, Twitch stream and not the screen share. It's your sign, Riley. Yeah, I know. Oh my it's... god, no. It's five. <laughs> it's That's that's inaccurate, I'm, I'm afraid. Hide. And now, hide. No. And with that, I say, smoke weed every day. Oh, god damn it. I hey, was hiding behind something and then... Dude. Yeah, um, you are so in this line of hey, vision. Misty. Oh, hey, Misty. 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 Misty I'm in a noogie. She's just gonna use her magic to, like, knock you back. Like, nope. What? <laughs> No, I just smell in his tummy after he released me from the- No! <laughs> <laughs> Ow! There you go. Kick 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 where the hell would the skulls room be? Red room. This room? Nope. But the red room. The drill boots in, in one of these rooms. Yeah, we already got the boots. Okay. Okay. Get on your boots. No. Give a nice swift boot to the balls. Ow! <laughs> oh, now it's starting to, uh... Remind me not to get within legs length of you, Misty. Same. I don't want to get hit in the balls. Wait, 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 no, no, no. Uh, actually, the skulls room, I think, is on the left. Try Over here. I the left. There we go. Over here? Yeah, like, kick Maybe. boxes. I think it's in there somewhere. I think. So, uh, it went down the green, so... Unless it's on the ceiling. Skull. Yep! Skulls. They're not on our field. Right there! No, no, no. Go back. You're, you're moving too far away from me. Oh, it's here around again. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. Could wait, it be? You... Can you climb the wall? Not in there. In the big. All right, give me a second. Oh, oh god damn it! Run away! Hide! God Stay damn it! Me. I flew right into that. Why? Wait, is it on top of the statue? Ow! Yeah, I think it is. It might be in that. Go, no, 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 no. Go down. Go down a little bit. I see Parrot. Yeah, I saw that Golden's too. literally a moth to a flame. Down. Go up. Go up. And go left. And Keep going level. left. Nope. Ah. Ah, shit. Wait, I can climb up here. There you go. Oh, 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 red, red. In go in there. It's in that room. Yeah, with the gorilla. Or is it the one above you? Oh, damn it. Hang on. Gorilla. Let me... Let me Climb all the way back up. It's the one above you. There you go. No, I, oh, maybe. I don't yeah, think you can climb it that, that way. Right you need to go to the uh... next, le next layer. 
next level. So see what's in that. See, see what's so in that once... box area first. How do I get up there? Oh wait, there we are. Yeah. Spoop. Oh, turn to Jeffy. Spoopy. How would people like the Chip and Dale uh, movie, especially uh, they tried to replace the success of Hoover and Roger Rat? Wait, is that what they did? Like, that was a... I mean, I don't think that, but it's like... I can't, I can't really enjoy the uh, Chip and Dale movie. I haven't watched it, but I want to. It's incredibly silly, I'll tell you that much. Okay. I like it. The, the reason it. why I... Sorry, go on. I wall. just want to watch it because of for one particular character. <laughs> Red. It's the it. only... Go ahead. Me? I was just going to say, the only reason I don't want to watch it dig. is mainly because of all the story... About the whole... Um... You gotta dig. The arguments people have made against it because of how they... Ooh!